What's up? It's your girl Magic. We're here with the one and only David Thuggin. Yeah. We're also here with Evil Studios, and we got a little, you know, get to know. Mm. It's very interesting, you know what I mean? <laughs> you know? But we're doing an interview, you know, we just came off the video shoot, you know, and she was highly incorporated in it, <laughs> and you see her actressing skills, and um, that's what we're doing, you know? And, um, um, my first question for you is, how long have you been rapping? I wrote my first rhyme. It was 1996, you know what I mean? It was a poetry class. And, um, you know, I also came up playing alto saxophone in the band, you know what I mean? So I can write music and I know the time of the music and shit like that. But the way music is going right now, it's like motherfuckers call themselves artists, right? But an artist is supposed to draw something on a goddamn plain sheet of paper. These motherfuckers using tracing paper. You feel me? <laughs> All right, so tell me a little bit about how you grew up. Yeah, well, we you know what? Um, there, so let's I was it. um, I was raised in Raleigh North. You know what I mean? Oh, word. You know what I mean? That's Raleigh Boulevard and, okay. and shit like that. But you know what? I, I grew up right there on Blunt Street. I got my first double changed over there. Mm -hmm. Halifax. You know, like I'm a fourth generation Raleigh motherfucker. I'm from Raleigh, but my whole shit is that I'm universal, you know what I mean? Okay. And, and I don't want to be considered no local motherfucker, but when it comes to Raleigh, if you don't say my name, you got done see me, you know what I mean? Okay, so you saying you universal, that brings me to my next question. What makes you different from other artists? Like, why should we listen to you? Now, I'm coming through and I'm telling you something, man. I've really been through it, and... um. Man, like I said, man, these niggas be capping, man. Niggas ain't really real. And hey, man, look, man, let me look at this goddamn camera. These niggas be capping, man. Like, when I say this, y'all want to goddamn do videos and do this and that and the third, but you you want to talk about my life. But when when a nigga that want to talk about his life that really do it, you saying he's a, a, a liability. You understand? But you want to got them come here and talk about nigga life, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I, I respect the nigga that been through it. I'm done with that life, you know what I mean? But at the same time, any nigga that's got them hating on me or whatever, you know what I mean? They can get that word, you feel me? But I'm a music man. For the ladies, you know, I got to ask for the ladies. Is Mr. David Thuggin single? And if he is, what is the type of female he's looking for? I'm single, man. You know what? I ain't looking for no female. Music is my motherfucking, my love, you know what I mean? Okay. And I got a daughter, and my daughter 13, but oh. she about taller as me, so that's my love. But you know, a right, the right woman coming to my life, you know what I mean? I, I definitely would. I just was wilding out before the shit you see. I would love someone to come into my life and be able to get them tranquilized, you know what I mean? But unfortunately, that's not how life goes, you know what I mean? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so as far as your career goes, where do you see yourself in five years? It's crazy because, like, I really, any person, like, I can't even, I don't even see myself alive in five years. So it may sound funny to you, but this is what brings the fire to me. You understand? I don't put myself on a five-year plan, you feel me? I put myself on a two-year plan, like... Okay. Where do you see yourself in two years, mm -hmm. according to your career? Mm -hmm. Tour. Like, if you was to go on tour, where is the first city you gonna hit? We, we, we said city, but I say let's give us your top three. I say country. Okay. Because Africa is a, a, a continent that consists of countries. I would like to go there. I would like to go to Canada. Okay. Mm, um, but you know what's crazy? So international. You trying to be an international star? Right. Okay. But right now, I really can't even see outside of my state. I'm black. Okay. Um, 
blindfolded. You know what I mean? Mm. Yeah. No. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just okay, so what's your ideal Saturday? I'm just gonna throw this at you. Just just to throw it out there. My ideal Saturday, and I mean I get up. And I roll up like three but a fat ass blunts, you know what I'm saying? And cook a <laughs> breakfast. And I don't eat, I don't eat no beef and I don't eat no more fucking pork. You feel me? Okay. Yeah, that's it. That's what's up. Neither do I. That's what's up. You ain't about that life. You ain't got that life. Oh yeah. Mm. I'm not making juice and like that soft talk. You know? <laughs> but but um, my whole thing, man, I just like I get viewed as the type of person that's like, you know what I mean, to throw a life and just be bullying motherfuckers. But what you don't understand, when it comes to business, motherfuckers be bullying motherfuckers, bro. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And it be like, I stand up for the shit and like, you never go meet a motherfucker like me, you know what I mean? Okay. My motherfucker, look, my girlfriend is dead, you feel me? Got shot in the motherfucking face, you feel me? My best friend dead, you know what I mean? For you to sit here with your bestie, that's a blessing. You with your bestie. You feel me? You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. I don't have nobody. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And, 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 and when my folks come against me, I be willing to kill, steal, and destroy. Okay. And that's the devil's mentality. But we gods and goddesses. You know what I mean? Like you see this, this seven and a half. You ask me why I say seven and a half? Because... The brain weighs 40 to 48 ounces, you know what I mean? Okay. A white woman, a white man, they shit weighs six ounces. You gotta freeze dry it. You gotta freeze dry the brain, you hear me? Mm-hmm. Right? That's how you get to this. And every shit weighs six ounces, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? And, but but a black person or a black man or a black woman with knowledge of self, they have seven and a half ounces of brain, you know what I mean? Power, you know what I mean? With the knowledge of self. Meaning knowing you guys and knowing who you are, what melanin is, you know what I mean? But we ain't gonna get into deep today, you know what I mean? Okay. You will. It's basically mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Love <laughs> So lastly, my last question for you is what can the people expect from you for the next year coming up? Like what do we like <laughs> you got music dropping, you got videos dropping, like what is it? Are you getting signed? Like what's up? You know what? It's like unpredictability. Okay. You know, I feel like that's needed. I know what Dre gonna do. I know what the baby gonna do. I know the most. And then no, 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 no disrespect to my for film. You know what I mean? You come meet me, I'm gonna get a flat off you. you know what I mean? Okay. But what I'm saying, I'm David Thuggy. You know what I mean? Okay. No man been through what I've been through. Um. I don't think niggas is fucking with me, man. And, and, and I'm, really, I'm really, I'm really, I'm really, I'm really coming through. And the only thing that stopped me is death. And that's what's scary. Because I had a crew of motherfuckers with me, like 10 motherfuckers, you know what I mean? They gone. And one thing about life, man, is death, you feel me? But can't you tell them biting my thumb? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I can speak on the government. I can speak on motherfucking moon madness. I can speak on goddamn Harpo, you know what I mean? Like, I can speak on goddamn all kind of shit, but I'm choosing to be careful with my words, you feel me? But I'm not gonna be careful with my goddamn hands, you know? Okay. I can't beat everybody, you know what I'm saying? But man, it's a win, lose, a draw situation, you know what I mean? I, don't, I ain't no buddy, it's just like, I wanna do right, man. That nigga ain't trying to do right, man. What the fuck? But when we get this money, you gonna say this nigga David Thuggin is getting money and this nigga got that. Fuck the money, fuck that shit. I'm be one of the greatest rappers you know. My favorite rapper is Tupac, you understand? Ain't nobody fucking with him. My favorite group is goddamn Wu Tang, you feel me? When I do something, man, motherfuckers show up, you feel me? But motherfuckers forget what it's about, you know what I mean? Because motherfuckers wanna be there, you know that. I've been there before, you know what I mean?